Alright, since uh, I haven't shot this one yet, I'm just going for the center target. I'm sure it's going to be high like the other one. Don't appear to be in the paper. Luckily, we have that other target, <laughs> so I'll shoot it at. Uh, imagine it's high. You gonna shoot the close up one again? Pardon? Which target? Close one. to go over this real quick this was at 19 yards and the reason why is I had a target at 30 and when I shot at it I did not hit it so my first shot landed right here that is I am not sure how far I was this is the point of aim right here so that's about four inches high and two inches to the left. So I made a movement, quite a, quite a bit of a movement. And what I was doing was just trying to hold the rifle as steady as I could. And I was uh, moving the crosshairs from, I think I put them here and I moved them down and over and I landed there so then uh, I made a little bit more of an adjustment and I ended up here again this is just 19 yards and I was just trying to get somewhat to where I would hit paper and that is with the Ruger Ranch 5.56 
I've already made my adjustment, so I'm going to shoot one more time at that gray dot, then I'm moving out to the 30 yard target. I don't know if I can hold the camera still enough. I uh, tuck my elbows in real close, and yeah, it, it's going to be hard to hold it close. I mean, hard to hold it steady. I'm going to aim right at the center target. Are you ready? Yeah. Pretty good. Yeah, I'm just uh, a little high. A little crooked, man. Well, I may have went the wrong way, but it's such a fine adjustment. I can't tell which way I'm moving. Is that you? No, I, I adjusted the wrong on the scope. Oh. A little high, a little right. Yeah. <laughs> Same hole. Target? Yeah, target, but I'm going to shoot that clean left one now. Okay. Man, this is frustrating. I'm right, getting ready to shoot. I'm going to be honest, I have no idea where this is going to land. Okay. Where you, which, gun, which are you going to shoot at? Uh, same upper left target. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to shoot the target. That's pretty good.
Well, that was the same slightly left. What? What? Slightly left. So this target here, I've got a lot going on, uh, and I got frustrated as well because I kept making adjustments in the wrong direction. But anyway, uh, this was at 30 yards, and my uh, ballistic chart <clears throat> for this particular round, if I'm zeroed at 30 yards, then I should be zeroed at 200 yards. Well, anyway, I started off down here on this target. This was my first shot. It was pretty good. I just needed to go down uh, three quarters of an inch. I think that's what that measures out to. Let me flip my ruler over here. Yeah. Three quarters of an inch is all I needed to, to move down. Well, the second shot was here. So I made another adjustment and I went the wrong direction and I ended up way up here. So then I made another adjustment and I ended up here, which is only uh, a little over a quarter of an inch high. So then I, I moved up here this is shot number five right here, shot number six, and then seven, eight, and nine are right here. That's all one shot right there. So then I moved over to this target and I was all over the place. I shot one, two, three, four, and five. And when I hit five, I left it there. I said, okay, we'll see what it does at 75 yards. And According to my calculations, I should be an inch and a half, roughly high, at 75 yards. And uh, I'll show you what I got. I've got two rounds in the back that I know of. I'm going to shoot the paper at 75. And based off of where that hits, I'll shoot the water bottle. Okay. Yeah. Alright, so this is the last target. Now, I was shooting a 308 uh, also that day, and those shots, uh, the 1, 2, 3, and 4, were already in there. There's only one labeled as the 5.56. Uh, where it hit was 1 and 5 eighths inches high of center. And uh, what I did is I just moved it one click down and I left it. I did not move it right or left. I think that left is me pulling it just a hair. Uh, I'll have to get back out there and do some more groups uh, with it. But right now I'm limited to 75 yards. I can't shoot 100 or 125 because of all the grain I have growing in the field right now. But uh, it won't be long that I'll be able to get back out there and shoot it at uh, normal distances and check zero. But I want it to be zeroed for 200 and uh, at 200 my 100 yards is 1.85 inches high. 125 is 1.92 inches high. So right at two inches high, 
at the 125 that I normally shoot. So right now that's where I'm at. Alright, I'm getting ready to shoot the water bottle. Okay. I know when you're ready. I'm ready. You are ready? Yeah. 